they all speak the same language, and that's soccer. Come on, come on. Make it yours. Make it yours. Butler Boys Soccer head coach Mario Carrillo estimates he's coached players from about 15 different countries. They come here with one goal in mind, and that's to get a good education, which is Butler traditional, and to be part of a great soccer program and to win titles. That includes one competitive Congolese trio. I hate losing to them, and they hate losing to me. Like. If right. like I, if they lose uh, to me, I don't hate losing. I don't lose. If if they lose to me, they will like hear about it. Kevin Mulame. For Samuel, Kevin, and Benny Mulame, sibling soccer goes from the pitch all the way back to the neighborhood. We used to get like in trouble like pretty much every day of the week because we'd come home late from playing with our friends and together. But it's what ultimately helped make playing together so seamless. He's like playing in the backyard because. We still do it like to this day. We just go outside, we play like 1v1s, and then so we learn like what each other's gonna do. If someone loses, they wanna work harder. So if he loses and I win and I see him working hard, I, I know he's gonna improve. So that's why I gotta work too. Of course, that isn't the only motivation. The Moulamays look at the life their parents wanted them to have when they came to America from Congo. Our dad always tells us that he had a pretty decent life where we came from, but he just brought us here because he want us to experience different stuff. Their parents have done a fantastic job raising these kids. Their parents have recognized coming here how important education is, and they have instilled that into not just the three brothers, but their, their entire family. That's a big thing for me because I always try to remember like what we've been through, where, like, where we came from and stuff like that. That's what like, keeps me going every day. Reporting in Louisville, Tyler Griever, WHS 11 News.